Hi, and welcome to today's video. Today we'll be teaching you how you can make a glitch effect in HitFilm 4 Express. So to create your glitch effect, you're going to need two things. First, you're going to need the actual video clip you want to apply the glitch effect to. And the second thing you're going to need is some sort of overlay video or effect that you're going to apply onto your video. As you can see here, I've got three of these but I'm only going to need to use one of them to create my actual glitch effect. So where do you get these glitch effects from? Well, there are tons of places you can get all sorts of effects from, such as footagecrate.com. However, my effects were found from a different place. I simply searched up glitch overlay on YouTube and there's a bunch of results which come up. And what I can do is I can download each of these and I can use them in my videos. So for example, there's this glitch overlay here, which is two seconds long. And what you can do is use the YouTube to MP4 site to download these YouTube videos and put them in your HitFilm projects. For example, here I'm at YouTube in MP4.com. It's one of the many YouTube to MP4 sites. What you can do is simply paste the YouTube link in here and press download, where you get a bunch of download options from which you can download your video file. So again, there are loads of different effects that you can choose. You can go through them and decide which one you like the best, and then download that and use it in the HitFilm. Once you've chosen your glitch effect, you need to create a composite shot. So right click on your video file and press make composite shot. I'm already in my composite shot. The next thing you're going to do is to choose the glitch effect that you want to glitch out. So I'm going to choose one such as uh, this one. And I think this is the one that I just showed you. And you can see it just plays on top of our normal video. I've downloaded this in 720p, but my composite shot is a 1080p composite, so I'm going to just scale it up until it fills the frame. Now one thing you can do is to set the blend mode of this to something such as add, which means that it will display all the white bits on your video, and that will make it look somewhat glitchy. And this is a simple way that you can overlay this video onto your existing video. But to make it really look glitchy, we need to do something else. So we're going to go into the effects panel and we're going to search for the displacement effect, which can be found in your distort uh, folder. And you'll see that it's layer only, which means it can only be applied to a layer in a composite shot. All you have to do is drag this onto your original video. So I've got mine on my bridge.mp4 video. And nothing really happens at the moment, but when we go into our effects tab and we open up this displacement, we can select our source layer to be the glitch overlay. And what this will do is that wherever there's a glitch, wherever there's something on this glitch layer, it will change or it will move the pixels in the original layer. You can change which parts of the video move by changing the horizontal displacement and the vertical displacement values. By default it says red and green, but you can change it to something like luminance if you want it to select all the color channels. So if you want to make this effect really extreme, we can bump it up to something like 250 pixels and you'll see that it sort of glitches out with the lines as well. In addition, something that you could do to make your video look more glitchy is when you're exporting, use a lower bitrate because that will reduce the quality of your video and will make it look more glitchy. And once you've done that, that's essentially it. You've got your glitch effect ready to go. You can experiment with different overlays uh, to get the glitch effect that you want. So thank you guys for watching this video. If this helped, then please leave a like on this video, and as always, stay shy. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.